Hi everybody, this is Jason Kickline, the developer of Onsong, and I wanted to give you a sneak peek at one of the uh, pretty cool features that we're working on for version 1.4. Uh, you know, we're going to be adding a lot of bug fixes and, and a lot of features, but one of the main features that we've been wanting to add for a while is the ability to project lyrics using Onsong and iPad. So to do that, right here I have the standard um, VGA adapter that you get for an iPad. There's a 30 pin connector on the one side, VGA on the other side. We have our trusty old Sony, uh, I think it's a 19 inch monitor here. And um, what people have really requested are, are one, the ability to project lyrics um, for a congregation or for an audience, and also to um, show lyrics on stage to other band members or if you need a bigger display. Uh, I don't have the stage monitor uh, set up yet, but that's uh, coming soon. So all we have to do is plug this into the 30-pin connector of the iPad, like so, and start up on song. And I think I have the sound off, but it does give it an audible sound uh, when you do that. And what we can see over here on the monitor is we have a nice little uh, red gradient. Um, on song supports by default some, some colors and then also background images. So if I tap this icon up top here, I now have a menu uh, that, that shows me a preview. I could change the color of the background. I can um, turn the gradient of the background on and off. Obviously, it's easier to read with the gradient. Um, or I can also change the background color. So here I have a nice little sunset, and you can see the preview there. Um, then as I tap down below, it will show over here on the screen, as you can see. So all I have to do is tap a specific section of the song, and it automatically puts it up on display on the screen. That's it. And if you want to see what I'm doing over here, all I'm doing is tapping uh, specific sections to change which song it goes to. Um, there's a lot of options in here, and I do have to see why that image is not displaying. It was uh, displaying uh, earlier for me. There we go. You can see the background up there. Uh, we do have a couple of display options. Um, one, I can change the font size, make it bigger. I can uh, change the stroke, uh, the shadow that is being displayed, uh, the transition speed, and basically this controls as I switch to various parts of the song um, how fast it goes to the next, you know, fades the lyrics in and out. Um, there's also an automatic advance feature, and this is great for if you uh, put announcements into OnSong. It'll basically automatically uh, go to the next section um, on, a, on a, you know, whatever time frame you set. And I think you can either turn it off or set it up to about 60 seconds, so you can display a, a section for up to a minute. And then down below I have different modes. Uh, so lyrics mode shows the lyrics in the background. I can tap that button to turn the lyrics off and just show the background. I could show a black background with the lyrics, or I could just black out the screen completely when I'm done uh, projecting. So I'm going to show you uh, real quick how this um, can operate using a simple five second uh, iteration. So I could start here, show there is a piece, it'll stay on the screen for five seconds, go to the next one. Now obviously this is not something necessarily uh, functional for uh, a worship set to, to automatically go five seconds in between, but you can see how it automatically does run uh, as you expect. So what I'm planning to do um, is you can see up top here it has sort of a projector looking uh, preview is the ability to slide uh, to a stage monitor. It'll look like a monitor, like a uh, regular VGA or DVI um, monitor and uh, it would allow you to see exactly what you see in OnSong. Um, you, as you scroll in OnSong, it'll scroll the page. Um, I'm also looking at doing a two-up uh, display on those larger monitors because of widescreen. We can get more information on there. So pretty, pretty exciting stuff. Um, hope you enjoyed this. I uh, hope it's coming to OnSong version 1.4. Thanks.